Okay, I've restarted the, um, the interpreter. Um, and what I wanted to show next is that what we've been doing with infix functions is actually the exception using an, op uh, an operator between its, its parameters. More often what Haskell is going to do is you're going to have prefix functions. So there happens to be this function in Haskell called the successor function. So what's the successor of three? It's four. What's the successor of the character A? It's the character B. What's the successor of the floating point number three? It's the floating point number four. So that's not the most exciting function in the world. Um, but the basic idea here is that functions are going to be prefix uh, the parameters. So what's the minimum, use another Haskell built-in, what's the minimum of three and four? Well, it's three. What's the maximum of three and four? It's four. Um, so pretty much this is most of our work is going to be um, with prefix functional operators.